right, so Garcia said this is a secret spot where you can come over here and you will be able to get like what? Unlimited boost or something like that? Okay, let's see if I get them. What we going what we gonna get right here? Let's hit the button. A grand mine! Hey guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great contents for my daddy. Good Okay, man, man, check this out, man. As always, full disclosure, yesterday we slipping a little bit, slacking on the pimping just a little bit. Almost 5,000 views, 4.4 thousand with 455 likes, man. Listen, the only way that we gonna be able to keep this up and get this thing going to the moon it's for y'all to continue to do y'all thing hitting that like button uh hitting that subscribe all that good stuff and comment down below man what y'all think in these videos man so before we get started make sure y'all like the video comment down thoughts down below y'all know what we're trying to go with this thing to the moon alice and if nobody told you this today y'all my brothers my sisters my family i love each and every last one of y'all now i know what y'all thinking jay 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 if i hit the like button what's in it for me well i'm glad you asked that question man you get to be immortalized instantly on the jay easy noti gang wall of fame anybody come through says first second third noti gang anything like that zinsk <laughs> y'all saw the video what it was called yesterday sensational yo i mean you know i can say y'all do that y'all gonna get up on this wall man if you had the top comment from yesterday you will be up here and this is gonna say hey just a tip for the people going uh to the house of randoms the first game you play you won't be able to back out but uh you won't be able to play 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 a 1v1 game or just grind it out uh with the people after that every game you'll every game that you play you will be able to back out and repick your teammates that's until you leave the theater you'll have to do it again when you come back in so hey that's what he's saying man he's telling y'all listen if you if you're tired of playing with randoms and all of that good stuff man all you got to do is head over here to the <laughs> head over here to the rack nation discord man listen man we got all the videos we got everything y'all we got to pull up to play with me we got the rec squads we got everything man come over here join the discord always got people to play with you can talk to me we can get this thing popping but uh also like you said go to the house of randoms do your thing and uh if after you play the first game grind it out you can quit with impunity after that and you should be good to go let me see if i hit this light right here let me see something Ooh, there i am right there in spectacular h mother -fucking d i ain't gonna lie to y'all man is it better with the light on or the light off we're gonna go with the light off man and just start the video off like this hit that like button make sure y'all hit the like button let's get the 300 likes before we get to 1500 views just hit the like button right now for your boy we trying to get to 8,000 views today and uh we just gonna start it off like this as y'all know james harden has been traded to the uh los angeles clippers managers and adrian warzanowski says the sixers are acquiring marcus morris nick batum i didn't even know he was still in the league boy rob covington he's got that then he used to play for philly i want to say and kj martin multiple draft picks and a uh and a pick swap for james harden and pj tucker and uh philippe petrus 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 i can't even really say his name don't 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 at me and uh sources tell espn tj says what do y'all think about this trade well i'm gonna tell y'all me and D, me and uh instant burner had a conversation about this and uh my boy real rap real shit, aka ronan nick he just he just said it like this man hey two or two out of three of them will be injured and one will start complaining because he's actually has to perform in the playoffs at that point russell will average a triple double uh on his way to getting swept by whomever uh we will revisit this tweet at a later date and i said to him yo bro that's exactly this is this is what i said bro i said bro funny thing is me and the instant burner had this had the exact same said the exact same thing down to russ not getting hurt and carrying in the playoffs and uh, uh and like he always does and getting first rounded or getting rounded or whatever it is right here also man you know um yeah that's that's what we got man like that's what i think but y'all let me know if y'all think that's gonna be good in hindsight it could be good you got russ coming off the bench running the bench squad he ain't gotta worry about nothing he already got his money and he's already good so he's good um james harden both, both of those two guys uh you got you got uh show enough aka uh Kawhi leonard and then you got paul george a, rel a reluctant scores or like they don't have to have the ball in their hand 24 7 to be efficient they're going to be very efficient but they're going to be you know what i'm saying they don't have to have the ball 24 7 in, able, in order to do so they both play off the catch uh but both of them can bring it up and take the pressure off of them so i think that it's going to be uh in in theory 
it should be pretty good but i mean we don't know man because like you said two out of three of them going two 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 of them gonna get hurt and then that's just how it goes but hey that ain't what we're here to talk about today what we're here to talk about is halloween today and this is what we got with 2k happy halloween put put on your halloween gear to earn double xp and go trick-or-treat around the city what y'all are seeing behind us is me going trick-or-treating around the city i'm showing y'all the spots and stuff man hopefully um hopefully you guys uh you know you can see all that good stuff and all of that and our, our good friend shoot everyone has uh he dropped a link right here and it's just saying uh it's just pretty much saying all the trick or treat locations uh for nba 2k24 don't miss out and so he's just saying don't miss out on that man because these are all the trick or treat locations and all that right there and uh pretty much you can see it's just around the city uh it's just th this block right here and then the, the next block and then all the way around there and like i said you're gonna see me going around here but this is a better map uh, to tell y'all exactly where you need to go and all of that good stuff, man. That boy Garcia actually came through and said, this is where I found, find this spot for unlimited boost. Now, I ain't gonna lie to you. I went to this spot. I did not get unlimited boost, but this is what he's saying. It's over here behind the uh, Lethal Shooter Gallery where Chris Matthews be playing that, man. And then he show you what he what he did. He went up there and got, uh, this is where it's at. You go up the steps and uh, do all of that. I, I got like 50 VC or something, but he said he got unlimited boost. Uh, I'm not sure why he didn't show it or what have you, but I wish he would have, but hey, it is what it is. That boy, All City Big Heck, man, he says, man, what do y'all think about this $20 beast bu bundle for uh, 20 bucks? Is it a W? And uh, this is what we got right here, man. It said for a limited time, purchase uh, purchase the beast bundle to receive 75K VC, uh, 10, six, 10 times six, I mean, you know, 10 skill boost per category. Uh, five times three which is three gatorade five gatorades per category and then you get a michelin s jersey or what have you get that shack jersey man y'all rocking with that i'm gonna tell y'all right now i'm not doing it um it is what it is it, it, i just feel i feel like it ain't no point because i mean well let's say 75 vc is 20 bucks but I don't, I don't see the value in it man i just keep playing the game keep earning my vc that way and keep doing it like that like i said man you're gonna see all the spots around the city if that's what you came here for uh it's just you know just just go around those but we got that for you but the ph to resistance the main of course the main entree man is this right here we're talking about shooting today we're talking about shooting shoot listen man a lot of people been talking about the stuff man how things have been changing i told y'all on yesterday i felt like i couldn't find my shot but then i found it and then i felt like uh was it was it that I couldn't find my shot? Or was it that that the, uh, you know, that I was playing? Like I said, bro, I see why it's so hard for a lot of people to find their shot because you play in the house of randoms. And like, this is what I tweeted out earlier. I said, all right, shooting might be, the, might be fixed. Uh, after two days and about 45 games, I finally found a team that was that, that would pass me the ball. I took more shots this game than in the, in the previous 45 combined. Five or six shots, bro over 45 games it's insane being a center on this game these randoms are insane and hey this is what we got for y'all right here man this is what i went in that one i went five for five that game um and actually everybody else was having trouble but hey i went five for five so uh i know that something happened to shooting on saturday or sunday evening it seemed like is when i felt like i finally lost my shot and then i started working back into it and when i found it again i'm like yo did i find it or uh, did I find it? Am I having trouble finding it? Or am I just not getting the ball in positions where I need to score? Because if people pay you, throw you bad passes in this game, if they throw you bailout passes or they throw you passes with bad uh, passing accuracy, which most randoms are going to have, it seems like that's what's going to give you that that fast, super fast jump shot sometimes, or you're just going to get a, a, a random catch or whatever. And so that's, that's what I've been feeling like, man. But that boy Iggy Mo said to answer the question, he says, 2K 100% reverted shooting sliders to day one. Guards are back to fading from uh, 33 feet with no takeover. Uh, everything smothered is going in, and you can shoot from everywhere with bads. Uh, am I bugging? Only thing, only, uh, thing different is the jump shot still don't feel good due to latency and i'll actually say that and then shock said low-key uh low-key don't think this is a bad thing game scores have been in the 40s offense need needed a boost and this isn't happening every game and then he said uh then uh he also said you know he says it's not happening every game and then so he says hey uh in case anybody's wondering not at all not at all do i think this is a good thing i'm just explaining what the, what i think the problem is tired of smothering a guard and watching the ball go through the net 
hey, I can't get mad at you for that, man. Like I said, man, I, I wonder, I don't know if I took a picture of it earlier today or something like that. Let me, I'm, I'm gonna try to pull it up over here while I'm pulling up Dime Work joint, man. But listen, this is what my boy Dime Work said, man. He said, hey, everybody on the, <laughs> every, this is really how the game feel. Everybody on my team builds houses for a living. Everybody on the other team is a 2K league prospect. Listen, I lose one more rec game. I'm throwing this controller. I ain't a lot of y'all, man. That's how it really feels, man. And so, like somebody said, man, hey, like uh, one person, <laughs> he said, he says, uh, shooting ain't really messed up. Um, it's just, it's just different now. Uh, dude, like me, put in mad hours learning to learning the original system, so it's hard to break the habits. And just, I mean, it just feels weird overall. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm trash for now. Uh, you might be good though. Really up to you, my G. And then, so he said, uh, should I stick with it? Should I, what he was saying, should I stick to making different versions of slashes or risk mental health to make a <laughs> risk mental health? Bro, we out here risking mental health to make shooters, man. Y'all boys bugging, bro. But hey, yeah, it, it is what it is, man. And then at the end of it all, somebody says it is a skill issue. And so down work, he just said, hey, he says, I, I have no idea what, uh, what I'm, I have no idea what I'm doing admits uh it's a skill issue the thing is it's impossible to develop skills when the game changes every week and i don't know what the new rules are and i said brother it's facts it's artificial difficulty it's not hard just stuff literally changed uh things are being changed with no warning and so with no warning like how can we adapt to it you just can't so like you get on the game and then you try to adapt to it and then you just can't do it man and it's just it's just one of those things where you you can't uh, you're not getting enough shots in order to adapt to it especially if like if you're a point guard and you're playing on a team and you know what i'm saying you're getting the majority of the shots you're gonna adapt pretty quickly but if you're a corner guy a wing guy something like that you may not get enough shots in order to find your shot in a timely fashion and especially if you're playing in the house of randoms who knows when you're gonna get the basketball? So that's just one of those things where we just say, hey man, it is what it is. We gotta just play the game and we'll see how it goes, man. But let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Um, do y'all play with a lot of randoms? And is it really, is that the reason you think it's really hard to find your shot? Cause when I play with Brute, I find my shot pretty quickly because he's gonna make sure we get the ball and he's gonna make sure that we get it in good spots, timely fashion, all that stuff. But when you're playing with, uh, when you're playing with, um, with randoms, bro, they might not pass you the ball, especially if you're the center. When you're the center, you you just like, you gotta get, and, and I was a lock too, but I was a rebounding lock. So I gotta try to go get the rebound and everything. And then, you know, everybody, they just get the ball to sprint down floor and stuff like that. Or as soon as you get the ball, they already gone. So you really just throwing the ball out. And, and that's all you are. You just playing a long range ball return, really, man. But let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I will holler at y'all next time. Till next time. Hey, it's your boy, Jay Easy, AKA Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, please, guys, please.